so, and lo and behold, on the 30th of June, 30 million Egyptians, if not more, took to the streets to demand Mr. Morsi's resignation. Only in Tahrir Square, where I was, there were about 3 million Egyptians, filled with a sense of hope, especially when the army helicopters were uh, flying all over us and dropped the Egyptian flag. And also when we saw the young policemen all clad in white arriving carried on people's shoulders, something that we haven't seen for a year, for a year or more since the revolution because they were uh, reviled and uh, they had left the street really. So this was the first sign not only of the police rebelliousness but also of the solidarity with the people. That very morning I was privy on the 30th of June, I was privy to an urgent meeting at former Minister Kafrawi's house and in the presence of Lewa Fuad Alam, for the Egyptians who are here, who was former deputy head of the security forces and the well-known uh, writer, Saad Hagras, and 10 or 12 other people representing labor and peasant syndicates and so on. And we were all wondering why we were gathered there. And Minister Kafrawi told us that they had been in touch with the army, with the Pope, with the Sheikh al-Azhar, and with General Sisi. So the army had requested from them to have a written popular demand for them to intervene and prevent a disastrous bloodbath. So we drafted it very quickly because we had to give it in before three o'clock. And by phone, we got the approval of 50 other personalities. And uh, such as the Hani Gibali, such as Gaber Nassar, the new head of the Cairo University, and many others of the same caliber, and we had it delivered to the armed forces before three o'clock. Part of the wording of the drafting said, you gave everyone one week to resolve the problems and to come to a compromise Otherwise, you will step in to prevent a bloodbath. So we are asking you to fulfill your pledges because we are on the brink of a civil war and a bloody and a blood and a real bloodbath. And so it was. By July 2nd, the Morsi era was over.